I just wanted to, to make it about people moving through urban spaces and because I don't work on a large scale, you know, they're, they're the height of kids usually or, you know, younger people. So I wanted to bring some youth to it and just, that's what kids do. They're on their bike, they're doing handstands, they're skating through. Um, there's a few adults sprinkled in there, but um, yeah, that was just my, it's like I take, took the people off the street and then popped them back in the street. It's been another opportunity to really um, work again with Manda, getting to know her at Blender. And then we did one piece for Women's Day uh, to 2020. And then we did uh, 2021. Um, and, you know, we've also just done random collabs together. Um, so this one again, you know, when she got those spots and that there was a pitch for that one, um, you know, we sort of said, could, could we merge um, so that was good everybody's so friendly like you could yarn all day if you didn't have work to do but yeah I found it to be really positive very relaxed it's just got that big country town feel I think it was just a really good fit for me like I've always loved street photography there's only so far you can take street photography in terms of what do you do with it you know unless you just keep making books I think it gave me that step back into that world and to work in thinking black and white again and yeah I just sort of did a few skaters randomly and fell in love with that silhouette and it became like this I just got immersed in that as a subject and um, people moving through the city you know whether they're walking their dogs or kids on scooters or yeah and I think it just really clicked with me and the process of Thinking through a stencil, how you'll approach it, I find is a good way to exercise your brain as well in a different way. So it was a nice step away from the computer. Just really happy to be a, a part of this world. I, I love it, yeah.